seen that for years. You're the best. I can see what's happening. What? And they don't have a clue. Who? Oh, they'll fall in love, and here's the bottom line. Our trio's down the tube. Uh oh, the sweet colors of twilight. There's magic everywhere. And with all this romantic atmosphere, disasters in the air. Mass Crusaders fighting all the time. <laughs> fighting <laughs> Holy fighting shit. all the time, fighting crime. Once in a while, a special, something special comes around. And I saw Rose throw three or four punches, and I knew that that was the evolution of the sport right there. That's the next, that's the next evolution of the sport. AM to the BM, BM to the AM. Rose! 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 So I did not know that Rose Nama Junis is one of the greatest to have ever done it. Hey, man, don't let my mom, don't show this on anybody to my mom will be mad. Because <laughs> you're not supposed to put no drinks on the piano. <laughs> Official weight is 114.5, 51.9 kilos. Para Elvia Jose Namayunas. Here we go. Thug Rose Namayunas. Putting the belt on the line, Jessica Andrade getting her second crack to become a first-time UFC champion. Oh, that left eye is not at all in good shape for Andrade, less than a minute in. Oh, and Andrade got caught the way in now. Counter left hook is one of Rose's best punches. If Rose is threatening submissions, that takes away one of her best offensive attacks. That big takedown. That Kimura does not work if Andrade doesn't lift her. Nope, can't lift there. She's still getting caught. So what is next for you? What do the next couple months hold? I don't know, man. Like going into this one, I was like, uh, this might be the last time I ever do this. But you know, we'll see. We'll take it one day at a time. Like this is this is a lot, um, but it's it's super fun. Like I had a great time. Um, is she really done? Was that the last time we saw her? And so here we are, six months later. Have you made a decision whether or not you will continue to fight? Yeah, um, I'll fight again, and you know, it's it's kind of one of those things where oh, you get a little emotional, but um, yeah, it's just like I lost the, I lost the passion for um, 
for you know martial arts and fighting mainly for fighting but um i uh i found my passion again i i went back to uh minnesota to see one of my like first uh one of my former like coaches like from earlier on in my amateur career uh greg nelson and you know he's just like a huge inspiration um for me and uh sorry i'm just getting all teared up right now They have been searching for not only a Chinese star, but a Chinese champion. Finally, out of Beijing, China, Weili Nagatong! You see me rise. Been amazing. She's incredibly talented. She's got an amazing personality. I love everything about this girl. Killer man. She's a fucking. Is she tw killer. twenty and one? She's like twenty yeah. in a row. She's a monster. I think it's safe to say she is a legitimate contender in this division. What you have done yesterday to my fans, you never do that. You don't f Polish nation. Where did you do that? And I will outclass you on Saturday. I promise you, you hasn't faced someone like me. Shut up. You, this, is, this, this is all what you know? I will shut your mouth with my teeth. Take care. This fight is five rounds for the undisputed UFC Broadway Championship of the World. The one that starts all the exchanges. That range. Oh. Maintain that classic moist. Oh! Oh! Beautiful. Oh. I'm talking about. Yo, J Check lead leg effectively does so again there. Oh my goodness. J Check best shots. In the impact deter her or it didn't hurt her then cuts them up and beats them up. Oh! Big bad. She's gotta hurt a little bit. Oh big body strikes for the former champion. Getting knocked out with due to the weight cut, not a scoop. Oh my goodness. Oh my that's a big left hand. Oh, oh. women's fight that was the greatest uh, women's fight in UFC history and still becoming an adult was kind of difficult <laughs> mm -hmm. um but yeah just just uh, losing my title and um all of that that sad <laughs> all of that ungratefulness and bitterness um I just went through a lot of different stages and I just kind of grown to understand some things that um yeah, it's just, everything's temporary, you know? So you just kind of have to live in the moment. So, everybody has been dying to find out where Fight Island is. So, uh, today I'm here to announce that Fight Island is uh, on Yaz Island in Abu Dhabi.
We just landed in Abu Dhabi on probably the best plane ride ever. Uh, I got this on the airplane. This is in my pajama, so honestly, these are better than my regular clothes. <laughs> so I'm just going to, I'll probably wear this every day. All right, next up. On the main court in the strawweight division, a matchup of two former UFC champions, Jessica Andraz versus Thug Rose Nama Yunus. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC strawweight division. Bonks her way into the clinch and then the slammer. But she's looking good here. She just trains with an amazing team. Pat Barrier. Andraz a little busted up in the nose area. And all indications are unlike UFC 237. Ooh. It's all day. It's all day. Time her. Don't throw hard. Okay. Just rip. Okay. Rip. Okay, guys. Okay. Okay. You got her. Hey. Let's go. She's slow. Oh, there it is. Oh, and a right hand from Andrade oh. now. An outstanding showcase for these two oh. athletes. Oh. And the strawweight division, deepest division in women's MMA, and a standing ovation yeah. from the UFC president, Dana White, as Andrade and Nama Yunus, unlike the first meeting, winner by split decision, Pog Rose Nama Yunus! How soon might we see you return, and do you think you've done enough tonight to earn another crack at the belt that you once owned? Uh, I was hoping to get in there pretty soon before the end of the year, but, you know, we'll see how my nose is doing, and then right. uh, we'll go from there. <laughs> After being welcomed to an empty arena in Jacksonville nearly a year ago, the UFC goes back to Jacksonville with a full arena for UFC 261. Three titles on the line. We haven't seen Zhang Wei Li yet in the pandemic era. It's nice to see her back, but I want to ask you first and foremost about these three title fights. Give me the number one thing that intrigues you about each of them. That intrigues me what? About? About each title fight. Oh, God. Well, obviously, Weili Zhang, you know, the, the, this absolute savage beast will be taking on Rose Namajunas, the absolute number one contender. You know, Weili is strong and powerful, kicks and punches, whereas Rose is very slick, you know, uh, great movement, great hands, and usually catches people with stuff they don't see coming. That's a fun fight. So... <clears throat> If everybody would join me. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, dear God, thank you so much for this awesome training camp. For everybody that's helped me get to this point. For everybody listening. Um, for everybody that supported me and my family, friends, etc. The UFC um, for this amazing show. Jacksonville for just, you know being the first live event back where we can be with the crowd and it's going to be amazing thank you lord for so many great things revolving this event and the journey to get here we thank you for this present moment we thank you so much for my team the coaches that have all so far made it and uh we're all healthy at this point and uh we thank you so much for all these blessings. We thank you also for my opponent, for uh, all the other fighters on this card. That's going to make it exciting, and it's going to be a great time. It's Rose against Rose every time. She's the best in the world, and she just got the mind, body, and soul all in one place. And when the stars are aligned, and there's not a woman in the world, I think that can, that can be her, especially at 115. I'm focused on the task at hand, you know, being in the present moment in control of myself and um, just focusing on performing and doing my best. And when I do my best, I am the best. Yeah, 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 yeah.
And that's great. That's all well and good. But you can't beat it. Walking out a packed arena, 20,000 people, people screaming their heads off, going crazy for their favorite fighters. You know, the fighters jumping on the octagon and celebrating for the crowd when they've just had a great knockout or whatever it is. Yeah, it's the greatest indoor sporting event on the planet. And now we're back full speed, 100%. Let's go. She is a natural born finisher. 21 wins, 17 or 18 finishes in those wins. The Chinese Express, she is an absolute monster. But I've got to be honest, and my, my head, my heart are telling me that Rose Nama Yunus will pick up the title once more and reign again. And now, this fight is five rounds for the undisputed UFC. Championship of the world! Let's fight. Given all the adulation and adoration that Zhang Weili has received, I think she was a little bit surprised. Weili has landed several of those. Ah! Ah! Oh my God!